Hey, heartfelt families, it is Mr. Justin. Um, today I will be reading a book that has a lot to do with numbers and counting because this week uh, through our morning messages and our small group activity, that's kind of what we've been focusing on. Um, so the book I'm going to be reading to you guys is called One Monkey Too Many. It's by Jackie French Kohler. And then the illustrator, so the person who drew the pictures, is Lynn um, Munsinger. All right. So I just read this book today. I actually, I actually hadn't heard of it before, but a teacher gave it to me and I really enjoyed it. So I was like, I'm definitely gonna have to read it to the kids today. All right. One said the bike man, the bike is for one. One monkey can ride it and one can have fun. But as soon as the bike man went back to his shop, one monkey too many jumped onto the bike. One monkey too many wheeled off down the pike. Hooray, the two shouted. We're having such fun. The bike is far better for two than one. So that's the first picture. So it looks like they are enjoying the, um, the bike, but other people are on it when there's some more people on it. And I think sometimes that's true. When we have more people participating with some things, it can be with something, it can be a lot funner. Then bingo, the bike hit a bump in the road. It started to wobble, it started to pitch. One monkey too many crashed into the ditch. So they're riding over here and then they kind of hit a bump and then things kind of go out of control after that. Two said the golfer, this cart is for two. If you're looking for fun, this is perfect for you. But as soon as those rascals climbed into their seats, one monkey too many hopped up in between. One monkey too many rolled off across the green. So you see they're playing golf. So when someone says off the green, that usually is referring to the green grass um, where people play on at a golf course. Yippee! They all wiggled and giggled with glee. This cart made for two is fantastic for three. They zoomed up a hill and they started back then. So I wonder what's gonna happen next. Then, oh no, they explain, exclaimed as they jammed on the brake. One monkey too many splashed into the lake. So you can see they started it and then they got all the way into the lake. I hope they're okay, let's see. Three, said the boatman, this, can, this canoe is for three. There's a seat on each and plus one more, don't you see? And just as the boatman was pushing them off, one monkey too many swung into the boat. One monkey too many aboard and afloat. They paddled quite nicely away from the shore. See, they said smugly, it's just fine with four. But soon up ahead came the roar of the falls. Wonder, I'm not sure roar of the falls. I wonder what that means. Yikes, they all screeched and they tried hard to stop. But one monkey too many had quite a long drop. Oh, so I think when they said the falls, I think they're talking about a big waterfall. So you guys notice they were on the canoe and then they fell down a big, they were, uh, fell down a big waterfall and they all kind of fell out of the canoe. Four said the waiter, this table's for four. You'll be far too crowded if you try to fit more. But of course, while the waiter was getting their drinks, so you started with four. One monkey too many squeezed into a seat. One monkey too many demanded to eat. See here, they declared. At the waiter's return, five fit just fine. Please do not be concerned. So he started the story with mon one monkey, and now there's five. Then out came the dinners, and forks started flying. Drinks spilled, and plates tumbled, and monkeys got rude. One monkey too many got covered with food. Five, said the bellman. The bellman is someone who works at like the front desk of a hotel. This bed is for five. I cannot allow any more to arrive. Oh. 
But the minute the bellman unloaded their bags, one monkey too many poked out his head. One monkey too many crept into the bed. See, they all agreed with a stretch and a yawn. We all fit quite nicely. The bellman was wrong. But as soon as they started to toss and turn, to kick and to twist and to sputter and snore, one monkey too many ended up in a war. Six, said the author. This book is for six. So remember, the author is the person who wrote the book. Six, said the author. The book is for six. The pages are full, and so no more of your tricks. But that noon when the author went out for some lunch. So this is the author who wrote the book. She's saying that six is too many, even for the book. One monkey, too many came sneaking. And look. One monkey too many got into this book. And that's the end of the story. All right. So I think, let's see, how many... I think we ended up with... Well, in this page, we have a lot of monkeys. I think we ended up with, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen monkeys at the end of the book. And we started with one. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this story. I sure did. Um, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. If you haven't done um, or seen our small group activity, um, today we're going to be working, working with money and sorting different types of money. So I hope you guys will be able to watch that as well. All right. Bye, everyone. Have a great day.